welcome back to SS Kitchen and today I'm going to show you how to make deviled eggs. So deviled eggs are really good for any kid's party or especially right around the corner we have Easter coming up. You can make these eggs for your Easter setup. So let's get started by knowing what are the ingredients needed for this. So we have three boiled eggs. It's hard boiled eggs and I have got here some aioli. It's as per your taste, some mustard and just a food color and a vinegar. I'll tell you in a minute what we're going to do with these two. They're gonna make them really interesting. Let's get started. So first of all, what we're going to do, we are going to scoop out the yellow of the eggs. So we're just gonna cut the eggs in the middle like this. And we will scoop out the yellow part because that's what the filling is going to be made up of. And here we go. That's it. Let's cut the other one. So this is what we're going to do to every egg and scoop out the yellow or the yolk as we call them. And this is the last one. Make sure once you boil the eggs, just hard boil them and keep them aside to cool down for a little bit. So that's, we have the eggs here. Now I'm gonna show you how we're going to make the filling. So for the filling, what we're going to do, we're just going to take two spoon of aioli and one spoon and a little bit of mustard. So we're just gonna take a spatula and start mixing it. We want this paste to be as smooth as possible. So if you are thinking it's not smooth enough with the enough um, with the aioli that you have put in or the mustard whichever prefers more you can put a little bit more of your aioli and the mustard you can switch aioli with mayonnaise just as per your preference no salt or pepper needed if you do like a bit of a pepper for a crunch you can make it i'm just making this for my son so i'm not going to put any pepper in it make a smooth better or smooth paste make sure all the lumps are gone and mix it this will give it like a smooth texture there we go we have the filling ready now we'll put the filling aside I'm going to show you a really fun trick to make these eggs so now what we're going to do we're going to just take this bag and um, put some vinegar in it I will just explain you why. A little bit of a vinegar and a food color of your own choice. I have red in my pantry, so I'm just using red and not too much of it, just a very little bit, just this much. And now what we're going to do, we're going to take some eggs and put it in here for the color. So I'm just taking, I have their six pieces, two and three. And just close them and give them a nice color like this. So what I have done here, I have put some red food color and a cap, this, this cap of vinegar in the bag and put eggs in there and just color them. It gives them a nice, attractive, devilish look. Okay, so let's start scooping them. So now we'll first start with one red egg and one white egg and then again one red egg just going to clean my hands on the side with this and one white egg again we'll put one more red egg and last white egg oops we can skip this one because we can't fill this up so here we go we have these eggs here and now what we're going to do, I'm just gonna put them aside. I'm gonna take another Ziploc bag and take this mixture that we made and put this in the corner and with your hand, just go back. Just take all of it and done. 
Now, what we're going to do, I'm just going to put the mixture as much as down I can, like this. Twist the top up. Now we're just going to cut the tip and scoop them. So, for the tip, just cut it a bit. Yeah. And then, with a steady hand, you can just fill them. like this. That's it. And if you want, you can decorate them with a hinge of a red chili powder or a paprika. So I'm just going to use a bit of a red chili powder to give it a little more devilish look like this. There you go. And that's it. There we have our fun, really fun to eat, very easy to make. We can You can use it as a canapé. You can use it as a party pleaser for your kid's party or just as a treat for the Easter. You can either have them in a white or color them like I did. You can switch the color from red to yellow, blue, green, whatever the kids like. And here we have the recipe for the deviled eggs. Do give this recipe a try and please leave in the comment how it is. And please do not forget to like, subscribe and share SS Kitchen. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.